Yeah, this is a uh, this is undeniable evidence right here. Okay, undeniable evidence. You know, that's that's a uh, 20 million dollars right there. Ballpark organist impact on a home game win percentage of case study. Hot dogs, penis, cracker jacks, the hallmarks of making a baseball park feel like a ballpark. But when you're in your seat jeering at the opposing team, they can't tell that your vocal cords are being refreshed by a $12 souvenir cup Pepsi, thankfully. One last park aesthetic does have the advantage of stadium omnipresence, the organist. The organ made its first appearance in the ballpark April 26, 1941 in Wrigley Field. Encouraging the Cubs with some music that was probably insanely racist if you knew the words. Pro probably. We're talking like pre-civil rights movement baseball. I attribute the Cubs 6-2 loss to the Cardinals on this day to this baseless assumption. Thankfully, in the years since, Oregon technology and civil rights have progressed to contribute to the lovely game of modern baseball. That's true and real. Unfortunately, not every ballpark is home to a piano player who got bored and tried using their feet one day. This is the crux of today's off-season deep dive, of course. Over the course of multiple painstaking minutes, that's a lot, I compiled an accurate enough list of every MLB team and whether they had an organist or not based on my fightings, Mets, Athletics, Guardians, Mariners, Orioles, Rockies, Angels, Royals, Tigers, and Pirates do not employ a full-time organist. Surely this would have an impact on home game morale. Absolutely. Looking at 2022 home games, teams with organists had a 53.8% win rate. Compared to a paltry 50.6 for teams with no Pied Piper. This leaves a difference of 3.2%, which applied to over 81 home games as two and some change. This means that MLB Orioles may have a war rate above league average. For, for those who don't know, this is actually a good point. Uh, the average war wins above replacement for an MLB player is uh is two two wins above replacement is typically the average zero to three war players are your average players uh when you're getting above three war you tend to be thought of as a good player and then when you get into that echelon of like six war plus uh your your uh top top tier anywhere between eight and 12 war usually is good enough to get you in the conversation of uh, of mvp so let's take a look oh this is the data dude where's us where's us oh yeah john shoot sits in the room next to the gm suite uh so there's the oh where's paint give me paint you have suites we're on the third level right behind home plate in this Sweet, right here. This is where the official scorer is. The official scorer sits there. And then uh, you have kind of wrapping around here, uh, you have all these different rooms. And all these different rooms are broadcast booths. This is like where the official scorer is. Uh, then you have like all of these. These are like all broadcast booths. Right here is the. GM suite. It's not like down the line like this, but just pretend for with me. Right here, this is like a where I I sit with other AGMs, GM, and directors. This is where I'm usually watching the game. Typically next to it, this is where the working suite is. So uh, this is where other people in baseball operations they sit and watch the game. Um, right here is where our organist is. Usually I I could hear him like warming up setting up but yeah that's this guy john shoot yeah this is a this is undeniable evidence right here okay undeniable evidence your organist has uh a projected x war of two you know that's that's a uh, 20 million dollars right there so for a few easy wins the gms of above mentioned teams can just go to a local conservatory and poach a student organist come on buck juilliard is a 30 minute drive from city field what's the excuse i don't know if uh buck showalter is the guy making that call billy or steve would probably be doing that most likely uh billy <laughs> but okay in conclusion 
support local artists because it will happily it will absolutely help your city's culture. That's true. I agree. I think I think that's all good. Moneyball 2 is going to be such a weird movie. <laughs> this is going to be like dueling organists. It's like dueling banjos or dueling pianists. What's a pirate's favorite programming language? Ar -ar 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 